ಬಂದೇಹಂ Now the the difficulty is that if one has to lead this life in the material world and yet our nature is to be in the spiritual world then how do we carry on our our living functions so this is given by the Bhagavad Gita this knowledge that knowledge actually is given by all scriptures that one has to use this human form of life not simply for increasing the animal functions of eating sleeping mating and defending but we should use this human form of life to develop knowledge of who we actually are uh, anyone can understand that i was when i was a small child i had a small child's body a young man's body a middle aged man's body and an old man's body and i can remember all of these changes so who is the i that is remembering the changes of the body who is that i which is fixed despite the changes of the body just like you can understand when we refer to my arm my leg my head i don't say i arm i leg i head it's mine so who does it belong to it belongs to the soul within the body now there's a difference between the soul and the mind the mind is a subtle material element just like earth is a gross material element mind intelligence and ego are subtle material elements but beyond them is the spiritual element of the soul and it is the soul that is actually the possessor of the body the difficulty is that the modern educational system gives all stress simply to this body that's no better than giving stress to one's clothing